All right, guys, this is part three. I have opened Trout and Judge. I've got Guerrero here. Um, best cards out of the other two ones were probably this Chrome Molina card. And then I got that Bo uh, rookie card out of the other one. So, um, I'm, like I said in the other videos, I'm kind of new to this product. I did get some doubles and put it like a, like a pretty good chunk of the set together. I'm hoping to get some more out of this one. Uh, to complete that set, but um, we'll see. We got uh, haven't got any autos or anything like that. There is what's exclusive inside these metal tens. Um, there are odds. It's really hard to see those odds, but I'll just kind of do that. If you want to pause, you can. Let me let me get one that's in an open container here. Maybe it'll be a little easier to read. So I don't I don't know. I'm kind of there. I think that's pretty good. So there's the odds if you want to pause and and, and uh, check that out. All right, well, we'll cut this open real quick, and we will see what we get in this last ten. Originally, I was hanging on to these uh, kind of for like an investment, but like any other Topps product, it's hot for about two seconds, and then nobody is really jumping up and down about them anymore. So, okay, big old brick of cards. See if we can get something out of this. Uh, we got a foil card in that first one. We didn't get anything like that at this last one. So I'll have, or out of that second 10. So right now I would say Judge 10 is probably winning. Um, I'm opening up this big, I'm opening this whole big old brick up guys. So there's what's in there. The darker cards are those turkey red cards. It'll be one turkey red chrome and then I think a throwback card that's also chrome and yeah a bunch of base so speaking of we'll start with base so here we go i'm going to go through these kind of quickly and of course they've got them all turned around okay let's try that again didn't want to spin them i was afraid to drop them so christian ellis there goldsmith still not used to seeing him in a uh, cardinal shooting Hopefully we'll get some baseball soon. I, I, I tell you, I would love it if those guys would play ball, even if they have to play them in Phoenix without crowds, just because it would just something on TV besides the news right now would be great in my book. If you see anything unique in here, please let me know. Steven Strasburg World Series. I don't remember that card. So let's see here. Photo. Oh boy. Lots of base in this one. Hopefully, I need a lot of these cards. I don't remember who I need. I just have a checklist. Pretty much when I uh, created that, I just flipped the cards over on their back and just pulled one of each and then put the doubles in numerical order in case I needed to pull something out of them later. I'm not familiar with the rookies, so I hang on to them. So here's a rookie, Steve, Sean Murray, rookie card foil. It's not too bad. It's like a Don Mattingly coming up after that. Got an Aaron Judge right there, 85. That's kind of cool. Hey, I'll take that guy right there. You know that. Justin Verlander. So that would be my number one card in here. Not that everybody would agree. So I do PC Verlander, so it's always kind of nice to get those. Uh, check him out. Rookie there. Here's the, uh, the uh, is it Ryan Hoskins, I believe? I, I can't remember his name. Is it Reese Hoskins? I, anyways, there's a parallel set of these or a subset. So we've got a Boston Red Sox Chrome Tops card, 2010. So I'm sure my buddy might be drooling over that card. Who did we get for the Chrome Turkey Red? We got... Alvarez, rookie. Nice, I'll take that too. So uh, I'll set these off. I am gonna put a base card on the bottom of that stack though. I don't wanna scratch the back of that Chrome card. Okay, more base. Molina. Yeah, what, or not Molina, what happened to Moncada? Is he, I mean, is he doing all right? What's his numbers? Batted at 315 last year with 132 games. That's not too bad. Home runs, 25. 
man, he may have gone on the radar last year. So, I don't know. I think everybody's projecting him to come out of the gates putting up those numbers. So maybe he's finally caught a groove here. Wasn't Mankata, wasn't he like the year before Judge was like the thing to, to get in cards? I mean, nothing against Aaron Judge. I mean, he's still a great ball player, so is Mankata, but um, the, I just don't think that he he did as well. So I'm kind of thinking Guerrero's going to be like that as well. So I don't get this card. Every time I see this come through, it looks like he got in a car wreck and he has something over his head as a bandage. I, I just, <laughs> it's just weird. I don't know why Tops chose that photo. I wonder if the players have any say so. So there's Guerrero again. I got him in the first box. Andrew Miller, former Tiger. Austin Red Hawks team. Philadelphia Phillies. Manny being Manny. A lot of base cards in here, guys. I mean, there's a lot of cards in here. What is there? 100 cards, maybe? 75? Rizzo I got already. Yeah, if you guys saw anything in here that I miss, um, let me know. Hey, there's the Verlander. I was I said that in the first video. I was like, I don't know if there's a Verlander. I've seen the Verlander yet, so I may not even have him in my set. I don't know. If not, then I have him for the PC. So and there's the last two cards. So not too bad. Um, happy with that one. Uh, that that turkey red Verlander card. Happy to get that. Um, that Chrome card. That rookie. I I cannot. I don't know all the rookies, guys. I just don't. I know somebody was hot from Houston, and I'm wondering if it was the Salvarez card. So, I may be wrong. Neat looking card, though. I don't, do, do they not come out with a Topps Chrome Turkey Red? Because, I mean, I'm looking at this card, and they should. Man, it definitely has a line going through the bottom down here. I don't know if you guys can see that on camera. So, there's a printing flaw on this one, unfortunately. But, anyways, guys, that's the haul. So, that is part three. That is the last of the three that I got. Keep smashing that sub button. Uh, when I recorded this video, I was 30 subs away from 1,000, which is a pretty huge milestone for myself. Again, I never thought I'd gotten, the, gotten this far, let alone to reach 1,000. So we'll talk to you guys. Bye.